It sits alone on the tree line amid a few scattered houses where the solitude is interrupted only by the sound of passing cars and the bells on the front door. But Flat Rock Grocery is a valued asset in its community. In tonight's Wayne's World, senior reporter Wayne Koval takes us inside. People start hitting the door right at 5.30. All right, bud, have a good day. Taking one home and hit to him. Hey, y'all want to do two of them? All right. Who needs a Michelin star when you have loyal customers? Come in here every morning, just the boat. Except Sunday. If it was open Sunday, I'd be here. I would walk here if I had to for a sandwich. The current owner, Joshua Stout, we bought it in 2016, has also been a regular here his entire life. You wanted the best cheeseburger around, you had to go to Flat Rock and get it. The renowned food, we make everything here, came about over the decades. Mashed potatoes, they're not, they're not instant. Potato salad, macaroni salad, it's all recipes, we do it here. It doesn't come out of box. But the food, I love my Philly steak and cheese. Is only one aspect of this community icon. A lot of people depend on this place. You know, you need lawnmower gas. You might pay a little more, but it's convenient. You don't have to drive to McKinney, you don't have to drive to Blackstone. Gordon Barnes' wife, Judy, owned and ran the store from 1995 until 2009. Just seeing friends and, you know, neighbors, family, you know. That's one thing I enjoyed about it is that you see a lot of people. They come all the time. When Gordon decided to sell in 2016. I told my wife if something happened in the store ever came up for sale that I would buy it just because the communities has been here so long. Um, I didn't want it to go away. And when ownership changed hands. We've pretty much followed along with what uh, Mr. Barnes um, had going. We added uh, more stuff to the menu. Um, than they had and stuff, but I mean, it's, it's great. And it does exactly what a country store should do. You got just enough, the essentials. From live bait to laundry detergent, from motor oil to pain relief, frog legs to big salads. Got hand cut ribeyes too. It means a whole lot to this community because when I don't feel like cooking, I come here and I get wonderful service. And with its future bright, the Stout family guarantees Flat Rock Grocery will remain the icon it has grown to be. Most days you wake up, it's like living a dream. I mean, how lucky and fortunate and blessed we are to have this. I mean, you know, it, it's, it's nice. The long hours haven't slowed down Joshua Stout's commitment to family and community. In fact, he coaches Little League Baseball and is on the volunteer fire department. His future, he hopes, includes a larger kitchen to keep up with demand.